Hi, I want to talk today about a new medication that's on the market for treatment of toenail fungus. It's a topical medication called Keratin. Now, Keratin is the third of three prescription medications that are on the market for this treating nail fungus. First one, which has been out about 20 years, is a drug called Cyclopyrox. Second one is Jublia, and the third one is Keratin. Now, Cyclopyrox, if you look at the studies on it, it works about 8 to 10% of the time when used alone to treat toenail fungus. Now, it doesn't sound like much. We actually use uh, Cyclopyrox quite a bit to prevent return of the problem, but we have other treatments that are much more effective for actually getting rid of the problem. So we don't really consider it a primary treatment. With both Jublia and Keratin, uh, they work much better than Cyclopyrox does in that they work in the 15 to 18% range. But that's it. I mean, although they work a lot better in Cyclopyrox, they don't really work that well as a standalone treatment for this problem. Again, I think they're quite good in helping to prevent the problem from returning, but I would never look at them as a primary treatment. Now, if you also want to start to compare price on these drugs, although Cyclopyrox is a little bit less effective, in fact, it is much, much less expensive. Cyclopyrox runs about $10 a month and you need it for about 12 months. You put it on every day for about a year. That's how long it takes the big toenail to grow out. So all of these drugs are used for about a year. Now, Keratin and Jublia both run in the $400 to $500 range, also needed for about a year. And that's again, $400, $500 a month. So you're looking at about $6,000 a year for these medications. Now they may or may not be covered by your insurance, but in fact, somebody is paying for these medications and I personally don't think they are effective enough to offset the cost of these medications. But for some patients, they may be a good way to go. Um, again, I think Cyclopyrox is probably a better choice for most patients. It's nearly as effective and far less expensive. But in fact, none of these topical medications should be considered a primary treatment. Uh, if you have toenail fungus, please go to our website and just do a search for guide on toenail fungus. You'll find information on every treatment that is available with the research that backs up which ones work and which ones don't. If you're in our area and you have toenail fungus, please make an appointment to see us. Uh, if you like these videos, please subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.